Hey YouTube, it's Michael Lambert here. I'm back once again with another reaction video. Once again, I'm reacting to Peep This Out in this video, Burger King, Candied, Bacon, Whopper Review, Peep This Out. This is the new one that he uploaded yesterday, and I'm going to react to it right now. And if any notifications pop up during the video, I apologize, and I will take care of them. Now let's get to this video. So here we go with the first major burger promo of 2024 over here at BK, and it's looking like a Whopper. Literally. Guys, the heftiness in my hand is real right now with this one. So sit tight, because up next, I've got their all-new candied bacon Whopper. As always, I'm Ian Kay, and you're about to peep this out. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian Kay. Stay frosty. Yeah, buddy, there's a lot going on with this particular version of the Whopper, promotional-wise, as well as what's on it. Guys, take a look at this. This thing is is loaded a lovely situation of crispy goodness some sweet bacon goodness there's a lot here let me break it on down for you fully before we get right into it so here we go with the candied bacon whopper from bk definitely a fast wow. food first for them with some of these ingredients guys a lovely situation starting off with that toasted sesame seed bun let's pop it and take a look underneath and you're going to notice a whole heaping portion of their all-new sweet bacon jam and chopped lettuce guys there's a lot going on there as we pan on down looks like we've got a couple of slices of tomato plenty of crispy onions underneath that guys as you can see it is loaded and mixed in with that some garlic aioli and one of the main stars of the show guys the candied bacon some sweet Action to go with the hickory smoke goodness with that one for sure and of course it's all on top of their flame grilled whopper patty so a lovely situation there guys definitely a front loaded burger for sure this one is loaded with the good stuff and it smells pretty decent as well the combination wow. of that candied bacon and the bacon jam is adding a little bit of sweetness in the air and you can really notice that it's pretty cool so let's not waste any more time on this one let's see if the flavor delivers this is the all new candied bacon whopper here at bk let's peep out this flavor you know, it's been a minute since I've seen a promo Whopper without cheese, and considering what yeah. this one has on it, guys, I'm not going to miss that at all, because there is a lot here. Definitely a lovely situation in the presentation department. And I gotta say, a super shout-out to my homie, The Endorsement. We were chatting it up recently when he was telling me about this one, and I'm like, you know what? It's been a minute since we've actually seen a promo Whopper or a promo King Burger, so lo and behold, here we go. And again, lots of us here, guys. Like I said, that bacon action is definitely smelling pretty lovely, but bacon jam on top of that, that's definitely a first for BK. Let's see if the flavor is going to deliver on this one. It's the all new candied bacon whopper here at BK, the first major burger promo of 2024. Let's peep this out. Mmm. Smoky. Sweet. Yeah, the bacon jam is strong. That's not bad. Well, I gotta say, this is a pretty unique flavor for BK, guys. That bacon jam is very strong. That's what's coming out predominantly there. And then the hickory smokeness of the bacon, because that's candied as well. It's got a high level of sweetness to it, but I'm not really getting any flavor from the garlic aioli. But that's cool, because like I said, the candy bacon and that bacon jam is lighting this one up. Of course, you've got the flame grilled beef patty in the very bottom there. And naturally, all the other goodies with the crispy onions. Not bad so far on this one. And hey, even though I'm not really a super fan of chopped lettuce, the fact that this has a ton of crispy onions to kind of help keep everything together, that's definitely helping. And in fact, inside the wrapper here, I have got plenty of the crispy onions. Let's try this separately real fast. Mmm. That's nice. It's like a light fry. Very nice. Yeah, I'm digging that. And they complement everything on the inside of this pretty nicely. Let's keep going in, guys. Pretty tasty. Mmm. Yeah, that candy bacon. That is the jam. Along with the bacon jam. Yeah, I'm not really missing the cheese on this, guys. I think that kind of would have drowned everything out wow. just a little bit more. But wow. so far, it's a lot of sweetness. The bacon flavor is definitely there. And I'm definitely digging the overall presentation of it, along with the crispy onions. Pretty nice. And again... Just an overall nice combination of flavors with this one, guys. I have to say, it's definitely unique, and it feels definitely different compared to what a Whopper should taste like. And that's primarily coming from the bacon jam and the candied bacon. So those are pretty nice new additions to this one, guys. And incidentally, in case you're wondering, they're actually running a promo right now where you can actually see if you can top something like this. So naturally, they kind of want to get some customer feedback in terms of what they can do in the future with some of these burgers. Not that they're running out of ideas, naturally. But hey, if you've got a particular idea on what you think would make an awesome Whopper, you may want to hit up the BK app and definitely 
definitely give it a go and see what you can do there. You may even win something. Who knows? But a lovely combination, guys. Again, very nice in the overall presentation department and the overall flavor profile with this one. I just wish I could taste that garlic aioli a little bit. It's kind of drowned out. So let's keep going in for a few more bites. Not bad, though. Mmm. You know, even though this has tomato, I'm not really minding it because the flavor of the bacon and the bacon jam is drowning everything out with that. It's pretty strong. Wow. And speaking of the candied bacon, considering the name of this Whopper is the candied bacon Whopper there, that is the main star of the show, I was actually given a couple of pieces to try separately. Wow. And uh, I really want to do that. I'm really glad that I was given this here to give it a shot. But as you can see, wow. look at that, guys. It really looks like it's got something in there. The seasoning in there as well. It's got like a glaze that's on it as well, too. Let's try this real quick. Oh, yeah. Oh. Wow. That's even stronger separate. The sweetness is up there, and the glaze, it's got like a little bit of pepper reaction, a little bit of heat. Wow, that is really good. I don't really taste the heat at all in the actual Whopper itself, but on its own, this is a pretty banging situation. Wow, that does have a little bit of extra goodness to it right there. Hold on. Mmm. Oh, man. I think I will do the other piece, in case you were wondering how many pieces were in here. Look at that. This is really nice, guys. Super crispy as well. And you can tell this thing is lathered in glaze. And it's crispy. It's sweet. The pepper coming up on the back end, that's the only type of heat that's here. But it is nice. Wow. That is a banging situation. This is really good. I would probably want to get this in some of the other burgers, which incidentally you can do. Here in Southern Cali, I believe it's like a buck fifty or so extra. Should you want to add the candied bacon to anything else on here, maybe the regular Whopper or some of the other options. But this is really good on its own. Mmm. That would be good on like a Western theme Whopper or something like that as well. That is really good. Bang it. Wow. So yeah, guys, a lovely situation so far with this one. And again. Nice combination of goodness. I got to keep showing it to you. That bacon jam, very sweet. But I'm really surprised how the bacon itself is a little muted unless you have it on its own. But the flavor is definitely there. You can taste it, the hickory smoke goodness, and naturally the bacon jam. Let's do just a couple of quick bites on this one, and then we'll wrap it up. Hang on. Okay. The Whopper patty is good. Flame grilled action, beefy, very nice. So yeah, guys, just a lovely situation of candied bacon action with this one, guys. I gotta say, a very lovely thing indeed. Naturally, with the candied bacon being what it is on its own, I'm already thinking of a Western theme, like I said, for the burger next time around. That candied bacon would be pretty good on it. But very nice overall with this one. I'm glad to have given this one a shot. Truly something different for BK, and a nice way to start off 2024. It kind of bodes well for the rest of the year. I can't wait to see what they're gonna do. But hey, if it's starting off as good as this one is right now, let's just say I think we've got a lot to look forward to. Let's go for one more bite, and we'll wrap up the review with the rating coming up next. Hang on one second. Mm. Okay, I need bacon, baby. Sorry, I had an itch on my nose. Sorry about that, everybody. Well, it's sweet, it's smoky, it's crunchy, and it's got that classic BK flavor from the Whopper patty itself. And overall, guys, a nice combination of goodness with this one. Absolutely give this one a shot. And do add that bacon to something else, because I'm telling you, it's worth going in on separately. It is pretty tasty with this one. All right, so with that said, I'm going to have to give the all-new Candied Bacon Whopper, the first major burger promo of 2024 here at BK, a pretty rock-solid 8.8 .8 out of 10. Guys, this was a really very tasty version of the Whopper, and while I'm not a super fan of ultra-sweet, this is definitely tolerable for what it is. But guys, again, that bacon is a beautiful situation on its own. Do add it to something else. I can't stress it enough for you. It's very, very tasty. Even as a snack, it's pretty good. But what you're getting with this burger is a loaded situation. The crispy onions, all the other stuff on there is pretty much vintage BK. With also that bacon jam thrown in for good measure i only wish i could taste the garlic aioli just a little bit with it but at the same time everything delivers flavor wise it's a very hearty burger and even though the premium's a little up there at 8.99 you're getting a lot to hold on to and a lot of flavor so it is worth giving a shot and i gotta say guys again 
Get the bacon separately. It's very tasty. Yeah. So now it's your time to shine. Do me a quick favor. Drop those comments down below. Let me know what you thought of the candy bacon Whopper over here at BK based upon my review right now. And if you're going to be giving this one a shot, how excited are you to try that candy bacon in general? Does that just sound like it's going to be pretty tasty? Because, guys, let me confirm it for you. It is. Do me a quick favor. Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is DNK closing out another high-quality foodie feature for you here on Peep the Sci Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Hey guys, I'd like to take a quick moment to thank all of our YouTube channel members and Patreon supporters. Guys, thank you so very much for your monthly contribution to the channel. It's because of your direct support that the channel continues to grow, and you really do help me to keep delivering the content that you want to see. I couldn't do it without you, and I seriously appreciate the love and support. Thanks again for all you do and for being such a big part of our positive community here on the platform. Hey, thanks for checking out this review, guys. But just in case you didn't see the one I did before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's going to recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya. Awesome video. I give it a thumbs up and I hope you all enjoyed this reaction video. If you're all new to my channel or to Peep This Out's channel, make sure you guys subscribe. Give both our videos a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell to let you guys know when we both post and share both of our videos with your friends and family members too, please everybody. And on my channel, we are on the road to 9,000 subscribers. And please help me bring my views and watch hours up on my channel by taking a look at my other videos that are on the two playlists that are on my channel. And give them a thumbs up and share them with your friends and family members too, please everybody. I would really appreciate it. And please help me bring my subscriber count up on my channel as well. Also, please everybody, I would really definitely appreciate that too. And I know a notification has popped up, but this video is almost over anyway, so I'll take care of it afterwards. And I'm off now, so until next time, see ya.